Have you ever wondered where to find the best box food in Kingston, Jamaica? Well, let's find out. Well, go on Zima Nation. Today, we're going to be going around Kingston to find the best box food with my friends Wall Street, Gabby, and Lauren. We'll be rating them on a scale of 1 to 10 based on price, presentation, flavor, and of course, customer service. Don't forget to smash the subscribe button and leave a like so we can make more videos like this one. Where are we going first? Sorry. We're going to Spanish Town. It's 444. Apparently, Sharps is the best box food in or around oh, Kingston. No. It kind of forced it, but apparently it's the best box food. So we're just going to go there first and then we can see how the rest of the place is stuck up compared to Charms. All right, so we're going to go to Chai's, Jamaican Cuisine, Charms, Suzy's, and Bobby's. I don't know if we can see the relation with all of them. Like all of them have somebody name as the food shop name. You see me? So if you have, have a name in front of it, then it just don't make sense. If somebody said Jamaican food, it just, not it just don't make no sense. It's the first time you're going to eat box food? No, mm. but I would never guess what the food box food. Restaurant. I have a grand. Wendy's. Yeah, I'm not spending my grand on Wendy's. I want to be full. Wendy's. I want to Remember, slap. I'm full off of a five piece. As a functional human being, you don't think say a box food would be more value for you? Like, money. So you're going to enjoy it. We're going to change you. Larry is going to start buying box food from now on. We're we'll turning her into a box food connoisseur. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, guys, so we're in Spanish Town right now and we're on our way to Charms. It's a good little drive, but I feel like the drive works. One thing with Spain, man, them, they might also for real. Like, on each side of the road, there's just a string of shops and like people selling things. And like, I respect the also from Spain. We're here at Charms. Curry pot and lounge. Who are you ready for? Tell them. What are we getting? Curry yes. goat. Curry goat and white rice. And a fried chicken. Curry goat so we can check. I've never eaten goat. Oh. goat. So you don't like goat? I don't know. She's oh, never eaten Alright, so it's her first time eating goat ever in her life. The price is about grand for a small curry goat. Fried chicken, 8 bills, 11 bills for a large fried chicken. Ambiance is terrible. Did he give you a hard time when you were? Oh no, quick and fast. Quick easy. and fast, easy. Why would I get the mix instead? Because we have to do, we have, we have to grade them properly. Have the fried chicken so you're not getting the fried chicken with curry gravy? Yeah. Yeah. So we have the curry goat different. So I went outside to take some B-roll shots, and before I could even finish taking my B-roll shots, the food is ready. Oh, what? Trouble. Trouble. Wait, this is just gravy? That no, like this is fried chicken. With the goat? To Yo. <laughs> so, Yo. <Yeah. laughs> <No. laughs> Alright guys, we're heading back into the car now and we're gonna review it. See what it is. Alright, so I'm not going to lie, still based on most food places, the price isn't terrible. It's good. Curry goat for grand. And it didn't take long at all. So mm -hmm. customer service. 9 out of 10. Mm -hmm. Presentation of the food, my lad, them, them load it up still. Load up. For me, presentation is 8, 9 right mm -hmm. now. Now it's just on to the taste. Chicken is pink. It raw? I don't no, know. No, it's not. It's just very pink. Ah! Mm. Oh, no. Oh, that's really good. <laughs> it's spicy but good. Yo. Yo. <laughs> when I mash up the food without it, bro. Mm. Yo, pass the food on us. What? Yeah. what? <laughs> yo, mash it up like so, yo. We need to give them a comprehensive review. That bad still. You gotta order wrong girl. Wow. It's not like a thigh. What is it? This is a thigh. But it's also the leg. leg. Mm. Charms! Mm -hmm. I feel like them drown it in gravy, which is good sometimes. Like for me, I love it, but I don't know if it's fire. Mm. Pasta bussing. Gravy kinda spicy, but not too not over spicy to the point where you say, yo, Jano, I can't eat this. Yeah. Mm. But it's pretty good. The chicken is cooked and it's hot. I don't know how them get it hot, like it just come out, maybe we came at a good time. But I'm sad that they got the order wrong. But taste for sure, I'd say a 9 right now. Crispy, nice. I'll give it a 9 mm -hmm. still. Mm. Okay, mm. can we have it back right? now? No. No, what do you mean? As a bonus round, why should you get the goat? Because Sham's goat. Tough. Tough. <laughs> <laughs> Lauren has to try it first, she's never oh, yeah. eaten goat before. Try it. Yeah, look for yeah, look on the food, you know. Yo, the man are looking at the food. <laughs> Come on. Uh, mash it up. We have more food to get, you know. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I wish I could have smelled it. Mm -mm. <laughs> Lauren's first time trying goat. Does it taste like, like does it, the texture? The chicken? No, it's like chicken. It's like chicken. Good. It's no. whatever. It's what? What? She white for real in the dark. It's more chewy. I've it had better goats. I've had tender, more, more tender goats. It kind of, kind of tough. Ooh. Oh, damn. <laughs> damn. I'm not going to lie. The curry itself, 
bad. I just feel like the goat itself wasn't tenderized enough. Maybe they'll never pressure it for super long. It have that little kick, that little spice where you want, but nothing where I go overpower you and ruin the whole meal, you see me? Definitely a solid meal. Yeah, I'm full. <laughs> Yo, I like how everybody's eating except me. No, I thought about the goat are bad. I just the texture of the goat oh, itself. You get mm, messy. Oh, the mess. Mm -hmm. Flavor. Flavor man. Mm. In the meantime, guys, subscribe for more. If you want us to do like more food reviews or like the best pork, the best jerk chicken, man. So let me know in the comment section down below if you like this series. This is good. How much other places we going to? Everybody else have some tough competition still, but we'll see how the day progresses. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Solid nine out of ten overall. The order wasn't right. Yeah, Alright, have... guys, on our way to the next location. Look at that, dog. You can be barking at each car that comes. You're not gonna bark off. So I, I can't care, white brother. <laughs> <laughs> There's a black carriage just passed. Oh, huh? No money? Mm. Wait, you can't ask me for money here. You, you, you collect your card here. What the? <laughs> out of order! Out of order! Out of order! Best for all the people who drive it up. Hey! I'm a quick one for Parker Pool. Hey! Best for all the people who drive it up. Hey! I'm a taxi one for Parker Pool. Hey! Fifty hey. man and rev rev your body. Hey! Mm. Now me say you pop one taxi. But we don't want to hear it because the girl best for all the people. Hey! 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 to try his fried chicken, hopefully they're open. Bobby's. Customer service, zero out of 10. Uh -huh. So you don't have no chicken? So you say, you want, you want to skip here some? I mean, it is late to be fair. Here, yeah, Bobby? Oh, yeah. big up, Bobby, big up yourself. <laughs> mm, now I get my money still in a father. But I will give him a try another time. So I actually did end up going back to Bobby's in the afternoon, like a couple days after, probably at like 3 p.m. But again, they had no fried chicken, so Bobby's is a no-go for me. Green girls, they saw some clothes on the roadside. Like See, what are you? What do you like? Surprise, right? How much is this? Five. Yeah. Five. 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 I can get a Everybody have to make their money. Isn't it? After Bobby's, we took a short journey over to Chai's. All right, so guys, we're here at Chai's Jamaican cuisine, and it looks like a like a spot to like build for real. All right, future sing here, and let me just tell you what happened there. All of our Chai's review video got corrupted. I'm not really exactly sure how or why. Chicken was. 9 out of 10, the rice they got, it gave us basmati rice. Um, I've been back twice since then and the food has been amazing. The customer service was mwah, delicious, 10 out of 10. They gave us free oxtail for Lauren to try. She's never tried oxtail before, so big up to Chaz every time. I'm actually going to call Lauren, Gabby, and Walshi so that way I can hear their take on Chaz. Hi Lauren, what's up? Could you give a brief review right now? Thank you, Lar. No problem. Yo. Hello. Could you give a short review on chives? It was great. Their rice was magnificent. Chicken was good, but the bone, the season reached out to the bone. Customer service was absolutely amazing. They, they looked like she wanted to look me, but you know, <laughs> that's alright. I would give Chai an overall experience of 8.5 out of 10. Huh? Hi, Big Ed. It's pretty good. I like the rice. I thought the chicken was very flavorful. The customer service was nice. And then also the chef came out and he was like, try my oxtail. That was really nice too. The flavor was good, but the texture wasn't it for me. A nine or 8.7. All right, thank you, Gabby. You're welcome. All right, so there you have it. That's the review on Chai's. I would say like a nine out of 10. I've been back twice and the food has been amazing. I'll let you guys continue to enjoy this video let's get back into this editing software line it up and we're at Susie's right now this place is open 24 hours on saturdays is saturdays 24 7 yeah yeah so the reason why we're here is for the convenience and also the ambiance is nice it's giving like starbucks vibes meeting vibes and they have more stuff other than box food too so it's not really like a box food spot but it's definitely a good spot to come if you want like 
sandwiches late at night and stuff like that. So. <laughs> that means you're on a lose already. So it's not a box food, it's a bowl food. Alright, so we want some fried chicken. Rice and peas? Small. We're here with you. We don't want olive rice. We just want to try and try see what chicken, you know? like, And chicken is? Yeah, man, late after the end. Uh, no, go on to the hard. You have thigh? Thigh can fit in. Ah. Mm. See my tongue right now? Mm. <laughs> see right thing, man? Yeah. Love it. Can you get the planting? Good. Planting. She want to plant it. Mm. <laughs> 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 Mm. Mm. We can't actually review in here though. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna right. lie. Top up, you know? Yeah. Batman 2250. Two we needed a bougie place though. Oh, look at the size of the bowl. Two grand. <laughs> Two grand. Alright, uh, you know what? We came here to do a review. Regardless of the price. Price, zero out of ten. I'm disgusted. <laughs> Presentation though. If I came here and ordered this, I'd give it back. It's Valentine's. I don't give a Presentation bowl. though, 9 out of 10 Valentine's. Because of the bowl? Yes, because of the bowl. I'm not giving them any stuff. <laughs> I'm not giving them any stuff. The food is so compact, like everything is just on top of itself. Did you count again? 2 2. <laughs> Alright, I'm not gonna lie. I did say the presentation was good, but the fact that I have to move everything around to exactly. actually eat the food is kind of inconvenient. So one by one we all tried the chicken and the rice and as you can tell by Walsh's expression Yeah, he wasn't really messing with it and for $2,250 Nah I'm not liking the rice, the rice is too mushy and the, the price top. is also And the price is not giving The price is mushy Unless can give you a rice <laughs> to be fair, to be fair, they're not a box food place. Yeah. You're paying for the ambiance for sure. You're definitely paying to be in Susan's. The food is just, I low key don't want to. I wouldn't come back for this. I wouldn't. Do I would go back to Chai's though. Chai's for sure. My thing is, this is a small one. How much Let me try the medium? Board. The texture is also not a. Not a vibe. Uh, what's that? Uh -uh. I don't want it. I don't want to carry that. I'm a waste of two girls. It was a waste of two. Waste of two grand. We should have gone to a box place. Are we here? Two at a time. Eight bills. Yeah, like a cheerio. Eight bills. Mmm, money burn up. <laughs> <laughs> my money, two grand just went down the drain, literally. But sometimes in life, you see, if we never did go and try, we'd never know. And some people are probably spend their money. And you know what she's probably like, like, yo, after a party, I got Susie still. If I came here after a party, But it's you, 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 you wouldn't come here for a box food. It don't though. matter. If I came the, here, the and I want it's food, amazing. And I got this after a party and I was drunk as hell and would I wanted good up. food. I'd be so bad. No, would have been up. I'm not going to lie. Two grand of my dollars. You're literally paying that? for the, the ambiance still. I'm, I'm good. I'm convinced. I'd rather go to Chai's. Chai's <laughs> bossing. I'm not going to lie. Chai's, Chai's is bossing. Alright guys, so that Susie's. I, I haven't tried the rest of their food so I'm not writing them off completely. But their box food, 2 out oh, of 10. Food. It's way overpriced. 0 out of 10 for sure. We could have gotten almost 3 box foods from the other places. Not going to lie. Very disappointed in Susie's. But kind of full still, not gonna lie. I underestimated how filling the food was, especially chai's, we ate a lot. This video is essentially over for now. If you guys want to see a part two, leave a comment and tell me if you want to see us do more food, travel, exploration, reviews. vlogs, reviews. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Follow everybody's social media, it'll be like somewhere on the screen, either here or up here, I'm not sure yet. Drinks. 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 Bye guys. Subscribe. Subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. <laughs>